Hey guys, my name is The X and I'm back to show you how to get story mode vehicles onto GTA 5 online. So we're going to do this in steps. So step one is you need to change your spawn location to last location before you actually do anything. Um, otherwise this won't work. So you need to go into online, press start, and then you need to go online and then actually go down to options and change your spawn location to uh, last location. And then, uh, yeah, you're ready to go straight on to step two. So once you've done that, we're going to go straight on to step two. So step two is once in-game with your selected character, go into a private online session. So, yeah, you know, probably know by now how to go into a private online session. You just go on to uh, online and then play GTA online and then private session. So uh, yeah, once that's loaded up and stuff like that, I know it takes forever to load up, but yeah, so uh, once that's loaded up, you need to go on to step number three. So whether you're on PlayStation or Xbox, I'm on Xbox, you need to go on to the uh, Xbox Game Store. So you just hit start, go all the way across to uh, the Game Store. So yeah, on the second loading screen, you need to sign out. So as you can see, it goes dum dum like that. Um, like the cloud zooming out you need to sign out on the second one of that so once you've signed out uh, you let that load up it's just gonna load up and load up and load up it should come up with a connection error you just hit OK and then it'll just take you to um, the loading screen again and it should load up the uh, the prologue of the first mission so this takes us on to step number five sign back in once you're on the first mission cutscene so uh, here's the cutscene um, of the first mission in GTA 5 um, so yeah once you get here you need to just sign in again um, so yeah you just sign in so uh, once you're signed in you, uh, you're you ready to go on to the next step so the next step is step number six load the same story then select the same character you started with so load the story that you started with uh, so you just go to there and then load story, load game. So I'm loading up my game here, and then yep. So once you're actually loaded up the um, the game, um, it takes you onto loading screens and stuff like that. So once you've loaded that up, you need to select your character that you started with. Um, I started with Franklin, as you can probably see uh, saw at the um, start of the video. So I just load Franklin back up, so there he is, and step 7, drive your selected car you want to take into online to your last spawned um, online location. So at the start of the video I spawned um, outside the Los Santos Customs, so I'm just going to drive this vehicle um, to the Los Santos Customs, because that's where I'm going to spawn, that was my last location online, so that's where I'm going to spawn online when I re-enter online, so um, yeah. I'll just drive this vehicle to uh, Los Santo Customs and leave it there. So, uh, yep, step eight, go into a private online session. So, same thing again as before, you know how to go into a private online session. Here it is on screen, play GTA Online, and then private session, invite only. Um, so, yep, you left the car there, let that load up, and, um, yep, you're ready for the next step, which is step Number nine, so go to the place where you left the car, it should be close to where you spawned. So I spawn outside Los Santos Customs, um, and you just need to run towards where you left the car. So yeah, last of all, step number 10, get the car. So uh, yeah, as you saw before, the actual car was left um, in the middle of Los Santos Customs, and it is here online. So I, I, th I think it like transforms over to where you left it from the story mode and then it spawns online where you last left it so this is Franklin's Buffalo you can take it in the Los Santos customs and you can also take it into your garage so that's pretty cool I also did this with um, Trevor's truck you know the one with the teddy bear on the front which is it'll come up on screen in a minute I'll show you what I'm talking about but um, I did it with his truck which I thought was really cool and I didn't think I'd be able to take it into my garage but I did so I've been the Wacko X please comment rate and subscribe and uh, leave a like down below, comment, and I will see you in my next video, guys. Goodbye.